It's now 6.33, new on Live at Daybreak this morning. Families will soon be getting ready for summer vacations. And one fun way to get out of town is to set sail on the Lake Express Ferry. The ferry will be celebrating its 15th anniversary season when it takes off from Milwaukee for Muskegon, Michigan later today. And with the new season comes a fresh coat of paint. It's the first new paint job since the unique high speed ferry started making that 78 mile trek back in 2004. On the Manitowoc River. It's a tedious process. At Burger Boat Company. First step in the process really is to remove all the old paint. About a dozen workers have the job of getting the Lake Express Ferry repainted. Are they literally rolling, using rollers little, to paint? Little foam rollers, yeah. That's, yeah, so that's that's an enormous space. So they've been, they've been, now you can see why we've been rolling for days and days. The work actually started in Milwaukee last fall and took all winter. The job had to be done outside because Berger did not have a lift big enough to get the 192-foot ferry out of the water. The vessel was covered to try and protect crews during the complicated process of prepping it for paint. During the polar vortex, the guys had a protected space. How do you think it turned out? So far, so good. Yeah. Uh, they, the, uh, the owner seems happy so far, so that's a good thing. One of the big differences for visitors will be the outside decks. The Lake Express opted for a lighter, reflective paint color this time to help keep the temperature consistent for passengers. We put a reflective surface on it, which we feel will create the uh, ability to keep a comfortable temperature down below. Also, the darker color, when it got hot, the ship would actually expand and change shape a little bit. Aaron Schultz has been with Lake Express since it started. The facelift caps off a $2 million renovation project, which included these new seats installed last year. But it's the new paint. It really has a wow factor. The whiter white combined with the ferry's unique shape. Especially the sun comes out. That Schultz thinks will make the ferry stand out. Why was it important to have a wow factor? Well, I, I think in a lot of ways we're representing our port communities. We're representing, you know, Milwaukee and, and the growth and the optimism there. Well, painting a boat has some similarities to how you would maybe paint your home. Strip the old paint, primers, a couple coats of paint. But it's also a whole lot more complicated because of the varying temperatures. Rain and snow can throw a monkey wrench into the whole process. And we talked about how the vessel is outside. So how do you think they painted right. the other side of the boat? You mean which for the... Right, because right. you're on the on the dock, right? Yeah. You can paint one side. How do you get to the other side? Oh, you got to be on a boat, right? A little nope, barge. Nope. They nope. actually drove it out, turned it around, turned it around. <laughs> <laughs> to paint the other right. side. <laughs> All right, let's get a wealth of things you did not know before, Brian. <laughs>